population grew rapidly. Such rapid growth of Alatra and widespread popularity among people started to frighten many, especially those in countries with totalitarian regimes. Evidently, they thought Alatra as an organization was secretly gaining strength, intending to wait for the right moment to enter the political arena. Therefore, those particularly concerned about their political future actively try to fight Alatra. Consequently, in countries where this occurred, fake and false publication about Alatra started to appear in large number. Alatra was literally under attack. Many of you, dear friends, have heard about what happened to Alatra and its participants in Ukraine. We hope that this just a tragic misunderstanding and that all of this will be resolved soon. As the president of the Alatra International Public Movement, I want to clearly declare that we have not, are not, and will not engage in politics. Alatra is not a political organization. For us, the most important thing is the lives of people. Yes, among the participants of the Creative Society, there are many participants from Alatra as well. But this is only because our goals and tasks are very similar. In Alatra, they are broader, ranging from studying the history of humanity to researching various branches of science. Still, the main goal is the same, to preserve life on our planet. To our great regret, Neither Creative Society nor Alatra is backed by any countries or organization, and no one sponsors us. And for your understanding, no one uses us for their purposes in opposition to each other, both in Alatra and in the Creative Society.